Hey dear friends, welcome back to the part 7 of Java FX and uh, Java FX to the part 21, as I think, or 22 it is. So, um, and the part 7 of uh, the tablet connectivity of our Java FX tutorial. So, in this video, I want to show you how you can make your table editable. Okay. So just call the object and call the set edit table method and pass a true value for that. Also, you need uh, another method to make your column edit table. Okay, uh, you need to add a text field. So to do that, just make a method add text field to columns okay any name you love any name you want column name that set sil call sil factory for the to do this not sil value factory okay and here pass just the text field table seal okay table seal dot for column name okay and column username dot set cell factory there's also text field table seal sorry about that what uh, text field table table seal okay that's correct there's a problem text field table seal dot for column for table column okay <coughs> for table column and column department also that said cell factory text field table seal that for table column okay <coughs> now that's great if you run your application why it is something problem Column department. Dots. So type of variable is that exists. Column table seal. Okay. Because because uh, this is department. Okay, so let's run again. Let's add some name. Okay. Yes, that's okay. But if you double click, it is still not change. Okay. Oh, that's because you didn't call the add uh, text field table column. There is some um, another problem. Let's see it. Okay, let's check that. 
God, what is actually the problem? That entity that the department cannot be to Java dot lang dot string. So just problem is for in column department I want to remove this. You don't need that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. But there is need to be commit. There is something there is need to be changed to commit. So open your fxml file. Okay. And go to your table and table column and go to the code and unedit commit. You'll make a name change method okay username change okay Yeah, let's save. And you can view the code from here, but right now we do not we didn't need that. So let's add them public void. It was name change. Okay. And uh, here we need uh, an event that is seal added event. Okay. Seal edit event Okay Let's import that Also the username is Yeah, this is also still edit event. Okay. So here we need to make an object of class students. And initialize it from table. You dot get selected model selection model that get selected item okay then std dot set name e dot get new value let's get the new value returns the current value you type it in the column okay the column text will string yes 
is also should be then here okay and let's make a method update name from update name using table the table seal text field says okay. okay and pass the std okay let's make this method that's great but let's go to the adapted column this is the adapted column okay copy that and bring it here paste it okay and instead of this remove this and instead of this <coughs> just pass the std this one Okay, and this city dot get ID. Okay, that's great. Let's run. So I want to change the navit. Okay, let's now see in the database. Now it is navit. Okay, I want to change navit to forward. Ah uh, yes, this event has been updated. It has changed to forward and I'll see here yeah that's that's forward also you can change the username forward okay yeah oh forward Oh, it doesn't work. Let's see what's the problem. Any CD is on it. Okay. The username doesn't change. But it works for name. For username, it doesn't work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We should call here. Set username, okay? Let's run again. F 
خواب یا that's work nice okay that's great now it works nice so thank you for your watching and see you in the next video and do not forget to subscribe my channel to get more videos and please like and comment goodbye